The Juvenile Justice Center on Galahar gearing up for the return of in-person court proceedings. And when they do get the green light to start those cases again, there will be a brand new waiting area specifically designated for crime victims that will act as a safe place for those folks. The extreme makeover is all thanks to a group of students from Del Mar College. Our Bill Churchwell reports. Welcome to the Del Mar Room. The Juvenile Justice Center is celebrating the completion of a brand new addition. The space created by folks with the Student Government Association at Del Mar College who transformed the room once used for storage into a safe space for crime victims. Here's the before and here's the after. It just gave them a place to be secure and have a place to relax while they wait. Sophia Jimenez is the group's president. She said not only did they brighten up the room with a fresh coat of paint, but also put in some new furnishings as well as some uplifting words along the walls. There are also plenty of stuffed animals. The Justice Center is where County Court at Law Number 5 is located. That court usually sees cases involving families and children. You know, with COVID, we had to put a halt to everything. So it was really nice to see that uh, during this is actually the 40th anniversary of the Crime Victims Week. So for this to come to fruition at the end uh, came at great time. The makeover will ultimately offer crime victims a safe and comfortable space away from an accused offender or that person's family. Judge Timothy McCoy grateful for the work by Delmar. People call it the kids court because that's who we have coming through here every day are our children and children that have been abused, neglected, victimized, um, and, you know, as a judge and as uh, people working in this court, you have to be cognizant of what they've been through. Artist Erica Kim worked on the mural seen on one of the walls, spending several weekends to get the image of this calming sunset just right. It was very healing to create this mural for others who are dealing with a very uh, uncertain time in their life. The room of first of its kind for this court. Bill Churchwell, 3 News.